The president's education secretary, Betsy DeVos, was confirmed today. It's official. Betsy DeVos will be our next secretary of education, and she is going to wreak havoc on public education. She doesn't want public schools, and she's fought against them in Michigan, and the charter schools in Michigan and the public schools in Michigan are doing pretty poorly. Every single Democrat in the Senate fought tooth and nail to stop DeVos. Democrats have been speaking on the Senate floor since noon yesterday. It is a last-ditch attempt to try to change the mind of at least one Republican. Parents and teachers in this country are freaking out. If you cannot be a champion for public schools, you should not be Secretary of Education. She cannot and will not uphold the law if she does not understand the law. Now is the time to put country before party. And all across the country, Americans spoke up to save their schools like never before. Something very unusual is happening. People across America are flooding congressional phone lines, telling their senators not to vote for DeVos. Some senators had to assign extra staffers just to man the phones. But in the end, Republicans refused to listen. The crowd was mixed with teachers, parents, librarians, and children upset with Senator Fisher and waiting for answers. Many here say they've called and emailed their senators senators and feel they're being ignored. But make no mistake, Republicans who voted to confirm DeVos will hear from Americans again when we vote in 2018. And there are two Republicans in particular that we can hold accountable, Jeff Flake of Arizona and Dean Heller of Nevada. These are two Republican senators up for re-election in 2018 in seats that we can win back. Head to Democrats.org to find out how you can get involved. And we'll see you at the next fight.